you spare some change, sir? Any at all, sir. Please. Ah, oh, thank Bless you, sir. you, sir. Have a Merry Christmas. Oliver, I do like this Christmas time of year. I do as well, especially when the orphanage gives us an extra ladle of gruel. Ever wonder why we get more gruel during Christmas time? Or why they put up all the pretty decorations? Or why the rich don't throw as many rocks at our heads? Maybe the rich people aren't as accurate with their rock throwing because their hands are cold. That might be, but it doesn't explain the extra gruel. Maybe it's because of Christmas itself. Well, well, what is Christmas anyway? Haven't you ever read the Bible? The, the Bible? I'm too illiterate to read. But you haven't even heard the minister read at Mass? I'm, I'm too illiterate to hear the sound of reading. That's pretty illiterate. Well, this is what I figure Christmas is about. You see, the Son of God, named Jesus, was born on Christmas. So, because Jesus was born, he makes people nice on his birthday? Yeah! You see, he makes the world act right. He punishes the bad guys and gives the good guys all the extra gruel they'd ever want. So why would Jesus do that? It just makes him sound like a bobby. Maybe that's why he came. To be the bobby of the world. Well, that does sound mighty nice. Don't mind if I do. And mister, you can't steal from orphans. That's not very Christmas like Bear Hamburg! Oliver, you said that Christmas was about everything being alright and the bad guys getting their comeuppance and the good guys getting extra gruel. Well, I don't know. I'm not some sort of minister. Classic Scrooge. That's not your money. What's it to you? It's not fair. It's not just. If the purpose of my coming to Earth is to bring justice to this planet, then there's only one way this ends. Who are you? Some call me the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. Others call me Jesus, which means salvation. I prefer Emmanuel. What's that supposed to mean? It means God with Uzis. 